that's a little bright. Let's tone that down a little bit. Looks pretty good to me. All right, let's get some snacks. Welcome to Taste Test Tuesday, where we taste test things on Tuesday. And today, we test out Smart Sweets. Now, I wanna start out the video to let you know that this is not a sponsored video. By no means is anyone paying me to tell you what I think about these foods. I'm just taste testing these things for fun. If Smart Sweets or WW want to sponsor me and send me things, or if you want to send me things to try and taste test, I will do that. Mm -hmm. But for now, these are just my opinions. All right, so if anyone hasn't heard of Smart Sweets yet, they seem to be the most popular candy that you can eat on WW. Uh, I see them everywhere. Uh, I personally always have this kind, love this kind, but we are gonna review all of the kinds that Smart Sweets offers. So if you don't know already, these are three points a bag. Yeah, three points a bag. Three points a bag. So you can, if you have the points, you can sit down and eat this whole bag, whereas like a whole bag of Skittles is probably gonna be a whole lot more or any other gummy form of candy. I will say that Smart Sweets by no means are extremely affordable. They are about $4 a bag. Maybe they'd be cheaper if you got them in bulk, but I definitely find them to be a treat. We are gonna start with my favorite. This is a biased opinion because I buy this one all the time. Um, it's not much of a taste test this first one because I'm gonna tell you it's amazing. But it gives me a reason to eat it. It's so good. Like, this one's my favorite kind. This one has a dense, gummy, chewy texture uh, and tastes like Swedish fish. Correction, sweet fish. I'm sure there's some copyright thing that makes them not Swedish fish. Anyway, 10 out of 10. Moving on peach rings. The peach ring has an outer coating of like, maybe a sour? Let's find out. Chewy. They are a little sour, not super sour. Also good, these are good. So here's the thing about me, I'm not a huge fan of sour candies. I don't like sour rings, any of those, just not my jam. But if you like sour things, I definitely would recommend these ones. On to the next one. Gummy bears. I haven't tried these ones yet, but I assume they're very similar to traditional gummy bears. Uh, we shall see. I'm obviously gonna pick the red one because red candies are the best candies. Chewier. Chewier than regular gummy bears. And maybe not as sweet, actually. Really chewy. All the candies seem to be really chewy. It's probably what, what they're made out of. And I'm okay with that. I like chewy candies. Next. Gummy bear sour. They look exactly like the regular gummy bears, but with sour on them. They're okay. They taste like the other ones just with sour on it. So far, least favorite. Not bad, just least favorite, that's it. And last but not least, Sour Blast Buddies. Now here's the thing, we go back to being a sour or not sour person. I'm not very sour. But I am keen on figuring out how these taste. So, it's more sour than any of the rest. But it has a dense texture like the sweet fish. So, if you like sweet fish, but want something sour, these are probably what you want. All right, as a final review, I would say that Smart Sweet is definitely a great alternative to eating any other candies that you could get from the store. I am going to rank them from my favorite to my least favorite, but I will say that they are all very good. So it's just up to you to figure out which one you like the most. Coming in first place, uh, shocker, sweet fish. Second place, peach rings. Third place, sour blast buddies. And coming in last, gummy bears. They aren't bad, they aren't my favorite. Um, that's just a personal preference. So if you've tried any of these smart sweets, I would love to know which one's your favorite and why. Let me know down in the comments below and let me know what you thought about this video. And by the way, the bags are about three points a bag. I promise you I did not eat five bags at three points a bag. So I am gonna wrap them up and save them for a later day. Cheers.